All right, guys. So once again, it's January 9th, 2018. Since my dumbass's Mercedes 500 fucking broke down on me. Dude, check this out. So I had that car since 2004, maintained it perfectly. I mean, every oil change done when it was supposed to be done. Everything, just golden, right? Well, I'm going about 115 in Lucerne Valley one night, and all of a sudden the, the engine starts to smoke and the car dies. I'm like, what the fuck? Well, apparently I had an oil leak, but it was burning up before it hit the ground, so I never knew. Um, and my oil sensor didn't let me know. That's kind of a bummer. Um, they, they, so the engine seized, and hence I have no, no more four-wheel drive. I've got my Saturn and my, my, uh, my Yamaha, my brand new fucking motorcycle, but that ain't gonna help up here right now. So anyway, I've got my umbrella so we can go out here and, and have a good time. Now, so what you guys need to know what's fucking dangerous here is walking with traffic like this behind you. It's so fucking dangerous, dude. So fucking dangerous. Cause they will skid out. You've got change on. What a fucking pussy. With all due respect. I'm just kidding guys. Do what you gotta do. Do what you gotta do. Woo! Alright, so I'm just getting out of the way. Cause yeah, this corner right up here, cars tend to eat it. They go around that corner too fast when it's wet. And pretty crack, 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 crack. All right, guys, so this is the best Western hotel. And I'm gonna walk through the parking lot. I'm probably gonna eat shit right here because I'm not wearing winterproof shoes, but who gives a fuck? Damn, it's coming down, man. It is coming down. We already have about a half an inch accumulation on the ground here. Fuck yeah, guys. Look at this, man. Woo! It's about time. <laughs> I think these, <laughs> I think the person was thinking, I was talking to them about how it's taking them so long to get from outside into the hotel. That's at least the look they gave me. So we're gonna eat shit here in a minute, guys. Thought I'd let you know because that's just how I do it. That's just how I do up in this motherfucking shit. In this shit, motherfucker shit. So we're on Moon Ridge Road, guys. Moon Ridge Road. Fuck yeah. So look right here. I hear accident after accident after accident coming along this corner right here. So do I love. Dude, hey, if you guys get a chance. Oh, fuck. Uh. I was supposed to shout out, dude, completely forgot his fucking name. Brother, I'm sorry, man. I'll have to shout you out later. Obviously give my my regular shout out to my really good friend, Gabriel. You guys have been a, a big support through all my my winter weather stuff and a bit of an irritation sometimes. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding, Gabriel. I love you. Oh, oh, actually, no, 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 no. Oh, there it goes, there it goes. Oh, no, no, no. Woo! Woo! Damn, man, we could have fun just sitting right here just watching people crash. But that's not fun. Oh my god, guys, look at this. Should I do a snow angel right here? I don't think so. Dude, this is so fucking pretty. Oh my. Alright guys, so let's just keep on walking. These boots are made for walking. And that's just what I'll do. And then I'll stick these fucking boots right up your pooper too. I am having such a beautiful time. Oh yes. We're having such a beautiful time. It's snowing, and I turn very feminine when it's snowing. <laughs> it's okay though. 
It's all right. I live in a state where I can identify as a, a fucking unicorn if I want, so. Or this rock with snow on it. You know what, that's what I am today. I'm a rock with snow on it. <coughs> and if anybody, if anybody takes offense to that, <laughs> fuck dude, I'm, sucks to be you. But I like to have fun, I like to joke around, I like to make fun of myself especially. I, I make fun of myself the most, you guys, so please don't think for all you new viewers that I'm uh, like uh, politically incorrect. Oh, I'm very politically incorrect because politically incorrect is bullshit and it's a way of patronizing people. Um, yeah, so anyway, I love you guys, man. I'm all about just fucking being real with you. And if I like you, I like you. If I don't, I don't. Vice versa. But anyway, it's got nothing to do if you choose to uh, declare you're a fucking branch from a tree. Or if you want to identify as like the left ball on some ball sack. I'm, I mean, whatever makes you happy. As I always say, you know, it, just do whatever makes you happier than a queer at boys camp and you'll be fine. But look at all this snow, ladies and gents. It is really dumping right now. Just fucking dumping. And then this fucking guy needs to slow the fuck down. He's gonna come slide right in me. You need to slow the fuck down, buddy. Yeah. All right. So that's Big Bear Boulevard straight ahead. Yeah, we'll just go around this block, but I'm kind of worried on this corner, so we're gonna go through the Walgreens parking lot. Guys, this is sick, bro. So you saying, man? Hey, man. All right, so let's get the fuck out of the way. As I said, I'm gonna eat shit on this fucking thing. I know it. And yes, I use a lot of curse words, guys. Um, if you don't like it, like, I'm really sorry, like, I really am. I'm not trying to, like I said, offend anybody, but I'm just putting out these disclosures for my new viewers. But just know, like, uh, I do this for you guys. I initially did this for me, but I realized how much people like this stuff, so I decided to do it for you guys, too, because you guys mean a lot to me. Uh, you guys have similar interests as well. This is, this is pretty amazing. This is pretty fucking amazing. Apparently at this restaurant right here, straight ahead, there's some like ghost stories. There's something going on over there. Oh, oh my God, it's so scary. The Captain's Anchorage, check it out guys. Read about horror stories at the Captain's Anchorage. The owner was found killed there or something years ago. I don't know if it was called the Captain's Anchorage. But it sure was the captain's final resting spot. Oh, look at this, my friend. Look at this. Now we're going to be like, hey, my friend. Oh, my friend, it's snow. Snow. Yeah, there's a W down there on the bottom right. Don't say I don't know how to smell, smell snow. Spell snow, motherfucker. Motherfucker. Damn. Damn. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my damn. Uwakasa, uwa, uwakara, uwakasa. I feel like Mary Poppins. I'm singing in the rain. I'm singing in the rain. What a glorious feeling. Oh, by the way, you guys, you guys drive up here. This place called Mountain Bar and Freaking Grill. I sing karaoke here every Wednesday night. I have fun doing it. I might not be the best, but I have fun. You guys should come in and have a good time. It's what it's all about. Just enjoying time with other cool people. All right, so now what we need to do is cross this fucking street in just a fucking Maui. There's a fucking crossing right there. Look at this fucking guy, huh? Crikey. It's a fucking crikey, man. He's a fucking crikey man, this fucking man. Alright, so. Uh, uh, see, I really miss this right across the street. 
all these empty parking lots, as soon as there's a little more snow, I would take my Mercedes out there and just absolutely do donuts like you don't even understand. I'd be doing donuts in like different languages, that's how cool it was. It was like So anyway. Fuck you! Oh look at cool guy! He's got his own fucking Oh, I wish I was fucking cool. Had my own snow shovel. Screw you guys, I'm going ham. Shit, dude. I am the cursor. I am the motherfucking cursor. So unfortunately, you guys, unless somebody can help me out, I got two issues. One is YouTube took away their editing software unless they, re they unless they've added new stuff. I don't know. Let me know. And second, dude, if any of you have a fucking spare GoPro or something that you're trying to get rid of for cheap, let me know, please, because I've got to get better quality videos for you guys. And I love doing our weather up here. I try to do every storm before, during, and after the storms, so you guys can get a great sense of what's truly going on, seeing it with your own eyes not hearing it from the media. Kind of like uh, certain people tweeting out there so uh, their message actually gets across to the people instead of the media fucking lying for the, just constantly fucking lying. So yeah, that's why I, I do this guys because uh, you'll see like, oh yeah, it's supposed to be like, there's a foot of snow up there and really, no, there's not. Like just not even an inch yet, but it's accumulating and fast guys. It's accumulating and fast. So. We're looking good, we're looking good. This hotel is so spectacular. It's such a beautiful place, man. It kind of reminds me of the hotel from that movie, The Shining. Anyway. So yeah, so if, if anybody knows or has a GoPro, a good one that they want to get rid of for really cheap, please guys, hook me up, man. I just sold mine a, a few months ago to buy my motorcycle. I sold it for cheap. I sold a bunch of stuff to get all the cash because I, I bought my motorcycle cash. So it was a, let's see, I sold it. It was a Hero 5 for 200, 200 bucks. And then, uh, I had a 200 and something gigabyte chip, which I threw in for free. I had three batteries and a, a dual battery charger that I threw in for free also. So it was like 200 bucks and this person got like $800 worth of stuff, but that's okay. It made them happy, but now I'm desperate. I need something good, guys. Oh, you know what? I think the shout out is Foxy Chris. I think that's his name, Foxy Chris. I'm assuming you're a chick. It doesn't matter, but I'm just assuming. Foxy Chris, kind of sounds like that. 